So let's see what works here. All right, we don't have no keys because it's like in a weird mouse mode. Well, that's no good. How do we set up the controller? Well, everything's working. Could turn Game Rumble on, but I don't really want to do that. This always wastes battery. The sound is great on this. It sounds awesome. Uh, I don't know if that is coming through on the recording here. But uh, very much like how it sounds. We need to figure out controller settings. Begin test. Left trigger. Right trigger. Run your finger across the whole surface of the left trackpad. Yep. Run your, sur run your finger across the whole surface of the right trackpad. Left joystick, yep. Right joystick in a circle. Press all remaining buttons. Yep. Our D-pad. Uh, shoulder buttons. Yes. We can press these. Our back buttons. Let's see, uh, volume buttons. Do they count? Is buttons to be pressed? I'm scared to press the power button. <laughs> it's gonna put it to sleep. Yep. Well, this is cool because we're gonna see how fast it wakes up, I guess. Which is pretty much instantaneous. That is really cool. Uh, okay, so our buttons work. Hold B to exit. Alright, well our controller works, so what's going on? We have to, at the very least. Steam input. To allow you to play any game, even if it doesn't support game controls, your deck uses Steam input, a system that translates your physical inputs into commands for the game. Commands can be any kind of input that games use. A B button on a gamepad, the enter key, left mouse button click, and so on. Okay, next. Each game's controller layout contains a list of all the physical parts of your controller and what commands are assigned to them. Okay, so B button could be the start button, X could be space, Y could be the middle mouse click, and so on. Customi customizing is as simple as selecting a physical input and your desired command. Steam input, deck verified games always have fully working controller layouts. So you can just fire them up and start playing. Well, that didn't work so well for us in terms of Portal for some reason. Uh, by default, they may not use the extra physical inputs the deck has over standard gamepads, but the quick settings section makes it easy to assign commands for those. Enable back grip buttons. Like you could, or your gyro. Okay, well that's fine. And I don't really care about this stuff. I really just want to 
get into portal. We can occasionally... Uh, da, 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 da. Let's try this one more time. Let's see what happens. 